I think Emery thinks he's like a little king. When we have a vacuum on, any animal will be scared of a loud vacuum. Or this guy just wants to go face on screaming. It looks like he's very angry at a lot of things. His very signature thing is throwing tissue boxes off tables. He's so angry that it won't cooperate with what he wants it to do. Even like my window wiper, he's sitting there and yells at them. Every few minutes, he'll demand to be petted. Most birds kind of just sit in their cage. But I don't think he knows he's a bird. It started because my fiance is allergic to everything, anything with fur. So we decided on getting a bird. We hand fed him because we wanted to have the most bond with him. People, they see a bird as like kind of boring. Our expectation was just this little guy that was gonna live in our house and kind of have his own space. But Emery shocked us. He started learning to whistle very early. Amanda taught him how to sing his name. He just did whatever he wanted. Every time we're watching movies, he's always like on our shoulder. And when we leave the house, if we put him in the cage, he's just screaming. I couldn't imagine leaving him at home. So we bring him everywhere we go. I definitely didn't expect him to be in the car with us all the time. But he just gets curious and wants to go. He comes to work with us. We call him our branch manager because he goes on the branch as well. If anybody comes, they have to get greeted by Emery. He has to go and say his hello to them and sing for them. And it's an exciting, positive environment that we have because of him. I feel like we kind of made him into a bit of a diva. I'm like, wow, he's such a good pet. We never regret the decision we made, and we're so happy about it. He's actually a family member. 